Hello everybody, my name is Riley Saunders, I'm a Village Idiot. We're sitting here at the 921 City Sound City Studios. We have an amazing night planned as we always do every single Wednesday. Tonight at 8 p.m. Central Time on the Village Idiots page on Facebook, you can watch a band play from the comfort of your own home and we're so stoked to have Sports Club. But first, we have Cade from Sports Club gonna sit here and play a couple songs for you acoustically. Make sure to tune in tonight, but give it up for Cade Reimer from Sports Club. <laughs> Hey everybody, I'm sitting here with Cade Reimer from Sports Club. How you doing, man? Pretty good, yourself? I'm doing pretty good. Tonight at 8 p.m., as you already know, I hope, you're going to find Sports Club playing a full set on the Village Idiots page on our web series Live at the Roslyn. It's free and you can watch from anywhere in the world. Uh, it'll be at 8 p.m. Central Time. Uh, right now, you just played an acoustic song. What are we going to be hearing Live at the Roslyn? Well, you're going to hear a full band representation of my music that I've been writing over the years. And uh, I've been lucky enough to have such wonderful uh, Winnipeg musicians join me for that. So that's been a kind of a dream come true. Right on. We'll shout out those people that are playing with you tonight. Mm -hmm. Well, if you remember, actually, one of our Live of the Roslyn shows from years ago, season one, you had me on for an acoustic <laughs> a performance. And I did a shout out no that band. night. <laughs> yeah, with no band. And uh, I guess since then, I've, I now have a band. Right on. Who's playing with you tonight? Tonight is Daniel Simone's. Um, Samoas. Oh, I think I got that wrong. Oh, well, <laughs> anyways, uh, Alex McKinnon and Ian Clements. Right on. And oh, uh, uh, sorry, and Kayla Goosen, of course. She's uh, joining us for a few songs on trumpet. 
Right on. And that's going to be sweet. So for everybody who doesn't quite know Sports Club, tell us a little uh, history about Sports Club and about yourself. Uh, it's been a writing project for mine for 10 years. It used to be called Explorers Club. That's what I used to write. I had a little notebook when I used to make my lyrics and it's Explorers Club. Uh, I just like the idea of like the old Explorers Clubs uh, from the 1800s and I guess more so <laughs> 1900s. And um, yeah, I just kept writing with that. And then uh, apparently there's a band called Explorers Club now. So then um, like they're bigger. Otherwise I would, wouldn't change the name. <laughs> And uh, we were just sitting down in jam practice and wondering, like, hmm, what should we call it? And I was like, well, I've been, always been called Explorers Club. And Daniel actually thought I said Sports Club, <laughs> probably because I often, like, trip on my words. And he's like, Sports Club? And I'm like, yeah, that's exactly what I said, man. That's perfect. And we just went with it, and we, uh, we knew that it had a good gimmick to it and just had... It was just fun. It was just a fun name. Right on. Well, I know every time I see you guys live, you are having a lot of fun. So I know tonight live at the Roslyn is going to be a wicked show. the crowd always has more fun sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> totally. So I know live just at the Roslyn. Just sports. Some, sometimes people come in sports gear to our shows. <laughs> um, at at uh, Shine On a few years ago before it was Hoodal, I guess, the last year. People just came like just... Like, like I think there was at least thirty people dressed up in different sports. One person was every sport, like <laughs> you know. So, right on. Well, good. speaking of Hoot Owl Festival, you're actually playing Hoot Owl Festival this year. Yes, I am. Very excited for that. Right actually, on. very excited for that. That's uh, so far at this point in time, as we're working on our EP, that is our only booked public show. Right on. So Hoot Owl Festival, so everybody knows, runs August 22nd to 25th, speech, featuring a sports club. But, you know, I think there's 17 other bands that are playing. That's going to be an amazing time. Make sure you check that out. Uh, we're going to get, uh, we're going to talk a little bit more about the EP, but everybody at home wants you to play another song. What song do you have coming up for us next? Uh, I think I'll do an old campfire hit that I, uh, that gets requested every now and then is um, uh, Sail Away. Let's do Sail Away. Right on. Here's Sail Away by Sports Club. <laughs> Hours, minutes, even seconds before the time I must leave. This homely bill feels paltry, and I think I'm slowly changing with the leaves. This time we pick up all the seeds. Plant somewhere else, somewhere be given love, water, and shelter far from me. So I'll take off in the last setting, so my back towards a wind. Slowly pushing me all the way to the sea And oh, I sail across the ocean To search for a shore that's gonna help me feel like I did before And oh, I sail across the ocean To search for a tide that's gonna help me clean out my mind And oh, I sail the way I sail
All right, everybody, we're back here with Cade from Sports Club. How you doing? Pretty good still. <laughs> Hasn't changed. <laughs> still doing pretty good. Uh, he's going to be playing a full set with his whole band tonight live at the Roslyn on the Village Idiots page. Tune in at 8 p.m. Central Time. You can watch from anywhere in the world, and it's free. You don't even have to leave your couch. Right now, he's just playing a couple songs acoustically, special for you at 92 City Studios. Uh, you have a new album you mentioned earlier. Mm-hmm. Well, it's, it's, it's coming uh, out it's soon. Coming out Tell soon. us a little bit about Hoping it. Hoping before uh, Folk Fest. So um, I want to have the album for the summer. It's an EP, actually. It's going to be five songs. And uh, yeah, we're just taking our time, making it sound really good. And uh, yeah, that's the hardest thing is making sure that the, uh, the songs are timeless. That they represent the song the best they can be. So in 10 years that you've been writing, how do you narrow down these five songs that you're going to do? Are they all newer songs? The ones that they... I finish. Yeah. <laughs> so whatever ones that the money allows you to finish. <laughs> That's basically it. No, lo- most of my songs I actually keep because I refine them and refine them and refine them until I'm happy with them. Um, I would like to actually learn to write songs more just uh, to learn to write songs instead of always sticking to one song, but I, I just, that's just the process of some working, so I just roll with it, I guess. I'm sure they evolve a little bit with the new players oh, you're playing. Definitely. Oh, definitely. So dynamics. many of my songs go through verse changes and style changes and speed changes, and uh, we even have alternative versions to some of our songs. <laughs> So right on. So for everybody at home who wants to check out your music online, where can they find it? Well, the best thing right now is Bandcamp, where we have uh, some of our old demos. Um, but they're just recorded by me in, in our Jansway's basement. I did the best I could for the knowledge I have. I like them. I listen to them sometimes, but you know, I don't know. <laughs> it's just, I just do. Uh, and uh, the other thing we just did recently is we went through Collector and B and B and did some live uh, videos. Um, uh, that are on, we have a YouTube channel now, and you just find that, I think it's just called Sports Club Band or something like that. Uh, you can just go to our Facebook and then or Instagram and you can find links through there and we have two live uh, songs for that. Awesome. Well, everybody, make sure you check them out tonight on Facebook Live at the Roslyn on the Village Idiots page. They're going to play a full set for you, fully plugged in, and it's going to be amazing. Look them up on Facebook, Sports Club Band, uh, on Instagram, all that fun stuff. And uh, any final words yeah. for everybody watching at home? Uh, no, I just hope you enjoy it. That's basically it. Like it's it's all about, you know, making sure that people enjoy the music and we enjoy the music and uh you don't have to get off your couch. We do. And we'll do it for you. <laughs> I'll be sitting on my couch in my living room while they're playing. <laughs> anyway, thanks a lot for joining us everybody. We'll see you tonight at 8 p.m. with Sports Club. See you later.